Hello and welcome to the Vainglorious Podcast, a professional wrestling podcast which you can only find on Chris R Gaming and Wrestling here on YouTube. I am, of course, Chris R. It is about 11.10 p.m., the latest I've ever, uh, possibly the latest I've ever recorded a video. The topic uh, for today's video is why do I love professional wrestling? Uh, of course, this is a pro wrestling podcast. I run a YouTube channel where I pretty much post nothing but wrestling related content. But one thing I've noticed recently is that for some reason, I can't explain, really, why I'm as passionate as I am about pro wrestling. Uh, someone asked me that a while ago, and I can't really explain it, or at least I don't feel like I can. Like, I can explain uh, some things that I really enjoy about it. For example, the uh, storytelling of wrestling storylines, uh, just seeing a good wrestling match in general, just having the emotions running high in a really good, impactful, hard-hitting wrestling match. But, of course, all of those things sound good. But one thing that I personally would like to know about myself is, why do I love professional wrestling? Why do I feel such a passion towards wrestling that I don't feel towards anything else in the world? And why does it make me feel so good, so happy? It's like wrestling literally helps give my life meaning. Um, Because I'm just that passionate about professional wrestling. And it's just like I can't really explain it. I can't explain why I feel this way about wrestling. And I guess nothing else. Uh, So I'm going to try to see if I can within this podcast, try to uh, break that down, uh, maybe give some history of, you know, how I got into the business, or gotten to be a fan of the business, I'm not really a part of the business, uh, hopefully I will be one day, but uh, yeah, so, uh, I have an older brother who uh, loves professional wrestling as well, and I have another older brother who used to be into it, not really as into it anymore, uh, and, uh, one day they kind of just, I guess, sat me down, uh, and made me watch wrestling from what they've, from what I've been told, because I haven't, I don't really remember it, uh, and apparently that worked, because I've been watching wrestling since, uh, maybe 2008 to 2010 on a consistent level now, and it's my favorite thing in the world, so I guess that has worked. I uh, uh, just started out watching WWE and uh, TNA, and I moved on gradually after a few years, I guess, to uh, watching stuff like Ring of Honor, New Japan Pro Wrestling, a uh, little bit of Pro Wrestling Noah, uh, Lucha Underground, which is like my favorite wrestling show of the 2010s, I guess, and uh, WCPW, What Culture Pro Wrestling, which is something I've made a video about, and things of that nature, and I'm, I'm proud of what I've learned about professional wrestling, because I've put in, even as just a fan, I've put in a lot of years of studying the business, I have a lot left to learn, but just the... Uh, the language, not really the language, the lingo, like Mark, and Smart, and Smart Mark, and Work, and Shoot, and all of that. Learning what all of that means uh, over time. Uh, it, it, mean, it really does mean a lot to me, and I'm proud of everything I've learned about this business. And, I don't, I don't know, like... Just some something about wrestling. It's a it's a random thing, I guess. Just uh, for some reason, I'm attracted to wrestling in a way that I guess I'm not attracted to anything else. And it it's really an incredible feeling. Um, it doesn't just apply to wrestling, but anything that you're passionate about can help give your life meaning, because people will be like, oh, 
Oh, professional wrestling, oh, it's fake, so it's bad, or once you get past a certain age, like when you're a kid, it's okay, but once you get past a certain age, it's not really as acceptable as you get older, but it's like, and apparently some people uh, think if you watch wrestling, you're wasting your time, but it's like, if I'm, if I'm feeling this passionate about something, if I watch wrestling, and I feel this passion about wrestling, get this feeling from wrestling, I am fulfilling my time. I'm fulfilling my life. I'm not wasting my life. And when you can find something like that, whether it be wrestling, whether it be music, whether it be anything, that's not... You're not wasting your time, as long as you're not doing anything bad. Like me watching wrestling, that doesn't do anything bad to anyone, doesn't hurt anyone. And I'm getting fulfillment from it, from it. So, you know, there's what's the problem? How is that wasting my time? It'd be better. It wouldn't. It's better than if I just didn't have anything I was passionate about. Just going through life. Just like for example, I want to get into the wrestling business. I want to own my own wrestling company one day. I feel like that would make me happy, which is important. That's important to be happy. I'd rather have that than just have a normal, regular job. I'd rather have that than sitting in an office or something. Well, I mean, just sitting in a normal office job or something like that. Because that wouldn't really be fulfilling. Uh, sure, I'd make money. Sure, I'd get by. But that would be more of a waste. If I've got this passion for pro wrestling... And why why would I not fulfill that? Um, I'm not sure if I have anything else to say. Um, I do know this has been a ramble. It's like rambly. I didn't prepare this. Uh, at least not 100. Uh, percent I I had like the idea. I I had some stuff like that I thought about before I came on here, but. Um, so, that is it. Uh, this has been the Vainglorious Podcast with Chris R. Like this video, subscribe to Chris R. Gaming and Wrestling. I'll see you in the next video.